Okay, so the first thing you'll need to do is make sure everything is turned on. So the printer has to be plugged in and then you just press the power button and then the iPad should be charged by the time you get here and the password is 033333. And it should pull you up to the check-in page. So the next thing you'll need to do is just connect it to the Bluetooth. So you'll go to the Bluetooth settings and select that. So if you're on the home page of the iPad, you're just going to go to settings and then Bluetooth is near the top. So you'll hit that and make sure you're connected to the device QL-820 dot dot dot. So then I'll go back to the home screen and hit the check-ins app and it should pull up to the roster form. So the roster is the list of all the kids who have checked in using the check-in app within the last three weeks. So it'll show you the options as ready, here, and checked out. So when you're looking at the ready tab, if I want to check in a kid, they'll show up under their household and it'll include information on their profile like their name, their birth date, their parents' contact information, and any medical notes or allergies that you would need to know about. So let's say I want to check in Isaac. So I'll go select the box next to his name and it should send the information to the printer and it should print off two parent security codes and one name tag for Isaac. So what's gonna happen is the parents will check the kids in prior to the service. So when the kids come out during the service and they're getting ready to line up and go upstairs, you'll just go through this list and tap the button next to their name and this will confirm that they are here. Cause right now you can see they're under unconfirmed, but then once I tap all their names, that confirms that they're there, which then enables it for the next step. So when at the end of children's worship, parents are coming back upstairs, they're giving you security tags, you'll have the iPad and you'll just press the little checkout symbol next to all their names to indicate that these kids have been checked out, which will then move them into the checked out tab right here. So I'm gonna go check in Isaac here. So I'll search for him outside of the roster cause he hasn't been checked in in the last couple of weeks. So I'll tap the button next to his name and it should check him in and send to the printer his name tag and then the two security tags for his parents. So this is what the name tag and the security tags look like. Now a parent will get this, and so when they come to check out their kid, they'll either hand this to you and you'll just manually check them out in the app like this. You'll confirm them as there when they get there. And then you'll check them out by pressing that button. Or another way you could do it is to open this camera feature right next to it, and you would just scan it um, like that. He's already been checked out, so he doesn't show up, but those are the two ways you can check a kid out when they come upstairs at the end of the service. 